Hi, welcome to the InterAxis YouTube channel, InterAxis.io. Uh, today we're going to move forward. We're talking about composability. It's something we, we discussed in a previous video, video and I wanted to uh, discuss one of the uh, more recent uh, dApps that's out there called DeFi Zaps. Uh, Nodar created this for the, uh, the Kyber Network hackath Hackathon. They actually won the hackathon with this. And this is an exa uh, uh, some example of composability within the decentralized finance uh, space, uh, specifically on Ethereum. So here's what they did, which is, which is really impressive. You have all these different uh, ways that you can kind of invest your money. You can, you can place your money in DeFi and earn some sort of return, right? So you can uh, place your money into um, uh, MakerDAO and come out with DAI, you're basically lending your, your ETH to, to create DAI. You can put your money into Compound or DYDX and earn interest. You can potentially put your uh, some, some of your tokens into uh, Uniswap pools and then you're earning the uh, pool, f the, the fee or the, the transaction fee, the, the liquidity fee, right? I, I'm uh, providing my, um, my tokens as liquidity within the, the Uniswap pools. Uh, there's potentially some uh, staking to be had. There's some, um, let's see, there's some potentially uh, trading fees. You, you can be in in some sort of synthetics, right? There, there are all sorts of ways that you could potentially earn money or grow your wealth, right? You, you can just do things like, uh, in, in terms of trading, you can um, buy and hold. You can um, buy with leverage, right? Where I, I, I can buy a, you know, 2x ETH token or something like that. There are all these different ways that you can, in DeFi, grow your money, whether it's earning through interest, whether it's earning through liquidity pool fees, whether it's earning by buying and holding and hoping that your, uh, whatever you have goes up in value. Um, all sorts of different ways to, to earn money, but it gets hard to keep track of them all and it gets hard to understand what should I do and, and how am I leveraging everything. So here's what what this team at DeFi Zaps did is they created a very easy way to um, make one choice. Say, here's what I want to do. I want to be uh, aggressive or I want to be moderate or conservative or, or whatever, but I want to earn some money. And I decide how much I want to risk, how much I, I want to put in the investment. And they, they basically go through several of these protocols, for example, and create several of the positions for you right away without your having to go from one protocol to another to another, connect your wallet, um, see the transaction, remember what you have. If I say, look, I want to risk half an ETH and I want to be relatively moderate, they can put it into uh, multiple investments. Now, I'm, I'm going to kind of start at the beginning going, going through what I did here. And, and one of the reasons I like it so much is not only do, this, do they say, look, here, here are the potential investments, go choose them, which is one thing if I'm a, a true enthusiast and I really understand all the different options and I go, well, I just want to make this slightly easier for myself. And by the way, save on gas fees a little bit because it's all happening in one transaction. They do that. However, they actually give me a questionnaire. So they have, they have uh, four or five questions there that say, you know, that kind of says, um, are, are you bullish or bearish in the next three months on, on Ethereum? Uh, are you, would you consider yourself moderate, aggressive, conservative in terms of just being an investor? Um, how, how risky do you want to be with your, your assets? How much time do you want to hold for? Things like that. So they ask me these questions to assess my risk and then what they spit out is here's one or two options you can have in, in terms of the investment, the zaps that they put together. They call them zaps. When they layer the different investments on top of each other, they call them a zap. And each zap might have two, three, four different protocols or two, three, four dApps that, it, that it's hitting to create my position. Right. So it turned out I was some sort of moderate uh, investor and I came up with the, uh, the maker uh, pool swap. So what they did was I chose, I think, half an ETH. So after going through there, I was some sort of moderate. And what it did was it, it gave, it put 50% of my investment into 
uh, I believe, maker tokens and 50% into the Uniswap pool, right? So I'm making money, hopefully, if the value of maker goes up. And then I get some on the side, you know, constantly by being part of the uh, Uniswap liquidity pool. Now, this is something I, I might not have even thought to do. These are options I might not have even thought of, but being that here's my investment, I want to invest uh, 0.5 ETH. It went ahead and did all this for me. Now, uh, for the moment, there, there's not a, a real easy way to, to track this, to, to really track what's going on. I can go and see what, what my maker token is worth. I can go into Uniswap and enter my uh, my wallet address and find out how much liquidity I'm providing and how much I'm earning. In the past, when this first, I say in the past, when this first came out, I don't know, a few weeks ago, um, there wasn't an easy way to get out of this e either. But next week or, or the week after or so, as, as Nodar tells me, um, there's going to be the ability to have anti-zaps. Anti and the anti-zap is basically going to you know, show you what, what you already have, and then you click another button and the transactions will essentially reverse themselves. So you can identify, okay, I, I've made some money or I've lost a little bit. Now I'm going to get out of this transaction. There are super aggressive ones, I guess, that, that you can get. You can go to, uh, I, I believe they go to DYDX or something. They get a 2X or, or 3X ETH or 2X or 3X rack Bitcoin or something like that. And they will, um, so if you're, you're really aggressive ETH, you can get one of those uh, go through one of those apps will do it a, a 2x ETH plus something else and it'll really uh, potentially grow or or potentially lose your money but if you've already agreed if you've already gone through and said hey I'm aggressive then they know that you're you're trying to be aggressive and you're probably okay with losing that money so uh, DeFi apps it's, it's really cool and, and it's a way that they've um, created to make it a little bit easier for me as as an investor again I, I'm I'm okay personally with being um, an early adopter, with being an enthusiast and everything, but I don't always know what's available and I don't always think of them. So the, this team has taken it upon themselves to think of what all the different options might be. Um, uh, again, using Uniswap Maker, I think they, they use uh, Kyber to make some of the, the transactions as well because they won the, the Kyber Network Hackathon. Um, so it's really interesting in a really cool way, an easy way to put a little bit money uh, of money into different uh, zaps, and really um, actually move in and and um, distribute my investment among different protocols and and different dApps here in a way that again they've asked me they they've kind of figured out what my risk level is, what my risk profile is. Being a financial advisor, I like that part because you're not asking someone to determine for themselves what the investment is. You're asking them who they are and, and how they want to invest, and then you're going, okay, this is a, a good investment for you. Again, we're not giving financial advice. We're not telling you to go do this. I'm just saying this is a great example of uh, a company, of a, of a group of developers um, realizing that there's a need for this kind of application, for this kind of dApp that, that will make it easier for me as the investor to uh, make these investments. Where I see this going in the future is the ability to uh, coordinate something like this with something like uh, a set protocol um, to, to be able to tokenize this, to eventually you know, put, put, have, these, um, have the zaps be tokenized so I can really track what I'm doing, have these potentially professionally made, have them put, potentially um, very uh, individual, ind individualized, very customized. I can customize my own zaps maybe for my clientele if I'm an advisor, if I'm a developer or something. Um, I can see this uh, um, actually be able to perform hedges, um, be able to de-risk myself maybe if I, if I want to buy one that's maybe 2x ETH, but have some sort of hedge in there that says if it goes down, I'm, I'm not going to get completely liquidated or something. So I can see a lot of possibilities with applications like this and pe people being able to see the, the popularity and build on something like this. So congrats to the team at DeFi Zaps. This is a really cool application. I recommend, if nothing else, that, that you uh, check out 
the, the video uh, DeFi du tutorials. I'll, I'll put the link here in the show notes uh, or in the, the notes for the video. DeFi tutorials. Chris Bleck did a great video showing how to um, quickly and easily create your own zap. So I'll put a link to his video as well where he really shows you step by step how he did it. Um, again, talking about composability, being able to build on top of each other. DeFi zaps is a great example of that. Uh, check them out. Uh, remember, subscribe to the YouTube channel. Interaxis.io is a website. Info at Interaxis.io. Hit us up if you have any ideas, you want to chat about anything. Um, at Interaxis8 is the, the Twitter handle. Uh, check us out there. Come have a conversation with us, and we hope to see you in the next video.